so many highlights, you know. Uh, so maybe I'll start by the beginning. Uh, in fact, for us, it began last year when uh, Chaco, Piripi, and uh, Hera and Tracy went to Tahiti uh, to inform us about uh, the, that event that will come this year now. And they also invited us to come here in Aotearoa. And we couldn't say no, just a yes. And after saying yes, we had to prepare ourselves to prepare also the the waka. We say waka, the waka for those for such a long journey. And uh, so we, I can say we work quite a lot, but the final result is just awesome, just awesome. Especially uh, when I think about our Tupuna, <laughs> just uh, voyage, by just using the elements without any instruments at all, and because they, they knew they knew the elements as well the sun, the the swell, the birds by day, and stars by night, and just. I just think it's so amazing, amazing. And we we had to do exactly like uh, our tunas. Uh, that's we, what we did there. Every day I was just uh, thinking, oh, I'm in the most beautiful place in the world. And then we go to another place and I think again, oh, this is the most beautiful place on the world. And every day, every day, every day. And we also met uh, Maori communities and at once connected. <laughs> because uh, we knew, they knew that we had just the same tupunas. And we also get uh, to, we also went to so many special places where our Tupunas uh, landed for the first time here in Aotearoa. It was either in Waira or uh, also when we went to Uawa and we went inside what it's called now uh, Tupaya's Cave. It was so, oh, so emotional. So emotional. And there were so many places where we couldn't prevent our cries. That's so such a great emotion. Mm. Mm. Two year to fifty, and uh, effective. Uh, it isn't finishing. Uh, it will never finish. It will always go 